Welcome back to another edition of Ringside Mailbag. We've got a blue flannel on today. That means I have a blue house and a blue window and a blue Corvette and everything that I do is blue. I'm blue, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, first question. It's a question that you guys have asked, I don't know, six, seven, eight hundred times. What and who is going to be in Elite Series 31? Well, I'd love to tell you, but I'm not going to. <laughs> nice nose ring, Bebop. Here's the lineup for Elite 31. And pretty sick. Will we ever see a blue Tista figure in his attire from Payback? I hope to see a blue Tista figure from Mattel. I mean, he was the number one trending topic worldwide, something I know a lot about. So the next question is, what's the deal with the Elite 29 Andre's Afro? Well, well, it's built from Mattel. He said it's like two figures in one, because you all have the old Maddie Collector exclusive. So now you got the wig, you got the afro, you got the singlet, you got the blue trunks, you got it all. Two figures in one. What are you complaining about, okay? Stop complaining on the boards, guys. And the next question is, will we see any more defining moments figures from Mattel after Ric Flair? I have no idea, but I hope so. I hope we see a Scott Hall, a Hulk Hogan, a Jim the Anvil Nightheart, a Bret Hart. And of course, Zack Ryder from the night I won the United States Championship at TLC 2011. The good old days. The people on the Wrestling Figs message board want to know, how many figures do I have in my collection? Thousands. I got Galoobs, Hasbros, Mattel, Jax. I got everything. ECW, WWE, WCW. I got it all, bro. But you know that I have every single solitary Zack Ryder figure. Make sure to buy your new one at WrestlingFigures.com. <laughs> Moving right along, the next question is, Zack, what is your favorite figure of all time? And that's pretty simple. It's the Elite 17 Zack Ryder. It comes with the sunglasses, the headband, the internet championship. I never wore the championship on WWE TV, but it's an action figure form. It's pretty sick. Go buy one today. I think they're pretty rare. All right, what's next? What's next? What's next? Okay, what attire would you like to see on the next Zack Ryder figure? I think Wait. it would look really good in this blue flannel, right? Uh, nobody looks good wearing the flannel. That was like two years ago, bro. Do you like, would you get that on sale somewhere? Maybe. Okay, well, please just, 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 just get out of here. Uh, but seriously, I'm actually gonna have a new figure. Like, they're gonna make another Zack Ryder figure? That is pretty sick. I'll be in this habit, I don't care. Bill from Mattel, make it. Make it a ringside exclusive. I'll buy it, my dad will buy it, my mom will buy it, Kurt Hawkins will buy it. Everyone will buy a new Zack Ryder, bro. Woo, woo, woo. You know it. <laughs> Dear Zack, I'm your biggest fan. Well, thank you. Now, Zach, are you on the Wrestling Figs message board? And if so, what is your username? Um, um, can't really confirm nor deny that, but I will say this. I do collect some vintage figs. Ah, <sighs> well, that about wraps it up for another edition of Ringside Mailbag. It's my pleasure to host, as always. Um, stick around, you know, next week we're gonna have some cool stuff going on. As always, leave your questions, comments, and concerns below. And uh, I'll see you then, yeah. I'm so good at what I do. What happened to Tom? <laughs>